Andrew Gillum. He's the socialist Democrat running for governor of Florida. He was the mayor of Tallahassee. He was confronted about free gifts he received while he was mayor during a debate last night in Florida. Watch this. You went to a Broadway show with an undercover FBI agent. You went to Costa Rica with these same lobbyists. And guess what happened? The lobbyists that wined and dined Andrew, they got a $2 million grant. My wife and I take vacations and we pay for our own vacations. I didn't get anything in life for free. Did you pay for then Hamilton? He to, then he ought to check himself. Well, Andrew, Why? Did, you pay the for the, did you pay for the you trip? You had your time, I will take mine. Because you won't answer the I question. I will take mine. Right. The question is, did you pay for the Hamilton ticket or did the undercover FBI agent pay for the Hamilton ticket? Did you pay to stay in the, under, the, the villa in Costa Rica? Uh, where are the receipts? You have not proven that you paid for anything, and that's the problem. So here's the direct answer. I don't take free trips from anybody. I'm a hardworking person. I know that may not fit your description of what you think people like me uh, do, but I worked hard for everything that I've gotten. <laughs> your description of what people like me do, okay. But what about the undercover FBI agent? And did he give you free tickets to Hamilton or didn't he? Well, Gilman explained that asking questions about FBI bribery investigations is, needless to say, you know the answer, racism. Many Florida voters seem to agree with it. They're at least unbothered by the corruption allegations. Gillum leads tonight by nearly six points in the Real Clear Politics polling averages. Mm -hmm. Lisa Booth is a senior fellow at Independent Women's Voice, and she joins us tonight. Lisa, Hi, thanks Tucker. a lot for coming on. So the Gillum race seems interesting, especially interesting, because there's this addition of apparently an FBI corruption investigation into the middle of it. Is that, what is that exactly? Well, there's actually two investigations. So there's a state investigation into some trips that Andrew Gillum took, and then there's also this FBI investigation. But the reason why all of this has come into the fold in the media as of late is there's this document dump, dump about 150 pages, basically showing that Andrew Gillum has been lying about accepting these a Broadway ticket to Hamilton, which he had accepted uh, from an undercover FBI agent. And that's what these documents demonstrate is that he did knowingly take this ticket uh, from a guy named Mike Miller, who was the undercover agent, who he thought was, you know, a business guy who was looking to do a deal with his city when he was uh, mayor. So that's what we know now. And then we okay, also... Okay, but, but, but yeah. I, wait, I just want to point out, just to warn our viewers, that Andrew Gillum has explained it, it's racist to bring that up. Well, right. And if you would look at our very, you know, storied history in the country of people of all different races coming under fire and in investigations for corruption, you know, it, it knows... Corruption knows no, uh, you know, race here. So I think this is sort of an excuse he's trying to use. And look, he's uh, with the big problem with the FBI investigation is he's saying that he's not a target, uh, but we we honestly don't really know that. And if you look at one of his close time, one of his close friends, this longtime uh, lobbyist Corey Adams, he is at the center of the FBI investigation, and so is one of his businesses, or a couple of his businesses, and one of them, which at our Gillum was on the city commission that, you know, voted to approve the deal.